Okay, this is Evan from Octane and Electrons. Today we're going to look at the AutoFix uh, 5600 um, OBD scanner. That's a uh, multi-system scanner. So these are really cool. I have one that specializes in the uh, forward um, diagnostic functions. And this one, I believe, is for Volkswagen and Audi and some other European makes. I don't have a vehicle that will show the advanced features of this, but um, we're going to go over it on my F-150 anyways. Um, you can see... It's the 5600, so this is just about full featured. And it includes uh, the scanner, wiring, and connector. So we'll go ahead and get that out. There's not a lot to look through here with the packaging, but we'll go plug it into the vehicle. So it comes with the scanner and connector, and it should have a USB port, yep. And comes with the USB cable, so you can connect it to your computer and do software updates that they provide, and the uh, link will be in the instructions here. So anyways, um, I'm not going to go through all the instructions. We'll go connect it to the vehicle and then check out all the functions that way. So we're going to put it on a uh, 2007 Ford F-150 with a 5.4 liter motor. Okay, so I have the scanner here. Get it connected to the OBD port, which is right under here on this truck. Plug it in. All right, scanner starts up. Let's see if I can find a good angle with no glare here. There we go. Okay, so I gotta put the key in, but um, here's our menu to start. So we'll look at the OBD functions. I don't think this truck will support any of these other uh, functions, obviously not for Volkswagen and battery monitor and oil reset. Um, this truck doesn't have any of that stuff, and I think this can scanner wouldn't talk to it if it did. So I do have the, like I said, the Ford version of the AutoFix scanner that does all the advanced features, and you can watch my video on that. It's really awesome. Um, okay, so I have my key on to the run position. And see all my lights on. Okay, so let's start with OBD. I'm gonna hit OK, and it should try a bunch of different of uh, the connection types till it finds the right one for your system. Okay, so we have our the multifunction indicator. I think the check engine light basically is off. There's, I've already scanned this. There's no codes set on this truck right now, so that's not great to test on because we don't have anything to read. But uh, we'll see what all it says. Let's try diagnostic menu, read codes. No. Nothing to erase. We can check readiness of... Uh, this should be for the emissions system, basically. <clears throat> and you can see all the functions, uh, all the monitors or whatever for emissions are all set green. I actually just did emissions on this truck yesterday because I bought it and it passed fine, so I know all that's good. So we'll go back. Um, when it's running, we should be able to leave read uh, live data. Okay. So... Pretty typical for the OBD functions. Most scanners have all that. We'll look at this other stuff, but I don't think I can do anything with it. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do any of the Volkswagen tests. Um, I don't need to or have an oil life monitor. I don't have a battery monitor. This is brake pad life reset, which this doesn't have. ETC reset. I'm not sure what ETC is. Let's see if it, I bet it won't communicate. Yeah, error communicating because this truck won't support it, I'm sure. Let's check battery functions. Turn engine off, which it is. Start detection. Please start engine, okay. Oh, nice. Okay, so it has a battery voltage uh, monitor built into the tool. That's pretty useful. Current voltage 13.7, so clearly my alternator is working fine. 
Nice. Well, that's pretty cool. All right. Let's go back and look at live data. Oops. <clears throat> okay. Should connect. Nice, that's cool. Coolant temp, fuel trims, engine RPM, vehicle speed, timing, air temp. Nice. Okay, so that could certainly be useful no matter what vehicle you have. Pretty cool. Okay. So, even if you don't have the Volkswagen, this is a useful tool just to read data and uh, OBD error codes on anything. But clearly, there's a lot of uh, advanced features for Volkswagen in this particular one. And Autofix makes these this brand with... Um, a lot of vehicle specific versions of this scanner so I would just say make sure you get the vehicle specific one you can watch my video on the Ford version it's the red scanner so that would be uh, really great to monitor stuff okay hope that helps on the auto fix uh, 5600